Welcome friends. Today I'm going to show you how to make your own envelopes for your slimline cards. Slimline cards are quite the craze right now. Many of us paper crafters have been making them for years. Until now, I'd used a standard white number nine business envelope to make my slimline cards. Last month when I started making my Mother's Day cards, I decided I needed a nicer, cuter envelope to send my mother and other loved ones. Around that time, uh, vendors, some vendors had come out with envelope builders to make the envelopes. I thought how simple it would be to make my own envelopes since I have multiple colors of card stocks. So let's get started. You'll, you're gonna need minimal supplies. Your finished envelope is gonna measure four by eight and a quarter inches and is designed to fit a 3.75 by eight and a half or less slimline card. Uh, here are the supplies. So we're gonna need an eight and a half by 11 card stock, which is one sheet, 30 to 65 pound weight uh, is what I found is the best. Then you're gonna need one eighth or one quarter inch double sided tape, a paper trimmer, a scoreboard with a bone folder, and a corner rounder uh, that's optional so let's get started now starting with the eight and a half inch width of your cardstock you want to score at two and a quarter inches then rotate your cardstock 360 degrees and score again at two and a fourth inches you'll end up with your cardstock divided into three panels of 2.25 or two and a quarter, I should say, and four inches and then two and a quarter again inches. After you've scored all four sides, you want to cut out all four corners. Now you want to turn your cardstock over and press your left back panel with your bone folder and your right back panel with your bone folder. Now this is totally optional, um, but I'm using my envelope punch board. Um, to round the corners of my top flap and my bottom flap. This again is optional and up to you. You can leave them as is if you'd like. Then you want to add your tape, your double-sided tape to your left back panel, your bottom flap, and your top flap. Of course, we don't need any on the right back panel. Now remove your tape from the left back panel. Go ahead and adhere that to your right back panel. And use your bone folder to smooth and press that down. Once you're done with that, go ahead and remove tape from the bottom flap and 
press and um, adhere that down using your bone folder. Now I did not add tape to my top flap because this is a demo and I did not want to waste that tape, but you of course would want to do so. Now here is an envelope I made, a baby card and uh, a white envelope that I made. So I just want to show you how nicely your slimline cards will fit into these custom envelopes that you've made. And that's it. Um, leave, of course, the contact paper on the top flap until you're ready to use the envelope. Easy peasy. Um, so hopefully Hopefully you can just sit and watch TV and make a lot of these so that you always have them in stock. Until next time, good day, friends.